I think many people are shocked by LTT store prices because they're unfamiliar with the higher end of the markets you compete in. Have you ever been shocked uh, by prices in unfamiliar markets before? Oh, sure. Yep. I mean, I made a whole video about what the heck is going on with high cinema camera prices. And the craziest part is red was a disruptor. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Get your mind around that. Red came in and undercut the cinema market, the cinema camera market. They they democratized the the creation of 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 high resolution like filmic resolution digital cinema. We talked earlier on this show about an MSRP thirty five thousand dollar graphics card, right? Yeah, that was probably shocking for a bunch of people watching. Yeah. I mean, it's, um, I remember talking about this on the WAN show at some point. I think I talked about this on the WAN show. I remember being called very out of touch for saying something along the lines of uh, consumer oh. computer hardware is not expensive. Oh, yeah. Because from a business standpoint, it's not. A GPU in the, when, when you, you gotta, everything is relative, right? A GPU okay, costs nothing to an organization like us in the grand scheme of things. Think about how many people Compared work to here. employee salary. We're, we're up to about... Benefits. For, for, for someone to be in the building for a pay period, okay, it's like GPU, right? And then, okay, well, that times uh, 26 times a year... <laughs> like it still matters yeah but. like every headcount we add is like equipping a quarter of our staff with an rtx 4090 <laughs> think about that yeah 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 right so s consumer electronics what i meant was for what they are it's amazing how little they cost when we look at what we got for a thousand dollars back in 1995 the fact that you can, the fact that you can buy a, a forty seventy Ti for a thousand dollars is mind blowing. The technological advancements, right? The, the I think the the like most easy to visualize version of that was when you talk about storage. People do this all the time, so this yeah. is not original at all. But you look at like old hard drives, like th this is how many hard drives it would have taken in nineteen ninety eight to amass a terabyte worth of data and yeah. here's like a uh, one terabyte micro sd card here you go it's like whoa it's wild yeah people are talking about this now it's like uh, ds2600 in float plane chat says i just bought a cisco router for 1.2 million for my company <laughs> is that outrageous <laughs> not if your company is going to generate six million dollars of revenue with it because that's the thing it's a completely different calculus Sheesh. it's not how much enjoyment will i get from this router or from this add-in card it's how much revenue will this generate for the company if i spend this thousand dollars that i am that i'm blessed enough to have to reinvest will i get eleven hundred dollars or fifteen hundred dollars or three thousand dollars assuming that i make very efficient use of it so uh, i forget how we started this question uh, what was the question? <laughs> oh uh, yeah, the the pricing of so have we ever yeah yeah so in the, when it comes to, to 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 business expenses, I don't think a quarter goes by where I'm not blown away by the cost of something because once you reach a certain scale, things that cost a thousand dollars become a rounding error. Like I remember we got a bill for some kind of stock photo service that we were using but we didn't have the right tier of subscription for like how much of it we were using and we didn't realize and they sent us like a thirty thousand dollar bill and i was like uh <laughs> what this happens with uh web service stuff like all the time oh yeah for sure yeah yeah so yeah it happens all the time and I mean, my response to people saying that LTT store stuff is really expensive is, um, okay, well, uh, you you go make it to that level of quality at that price. Our, our t-shirts are still 20 bucks. Go find, now, 
go find me another content creator that does printed quality shirts. No Fruit of the Loom, no Gildan, no crap shirts. Printed quality shirts With good for printing too. 20 bucks. Screen printed, not direct to garment. It costs f***ing money. Sorry, not sorry. Like, we, we, don't, we don't take ridiculous margin on stuff. Um, that's just the way it is.